We acknowledge the traditional owners of this land, the Bunurong people, and pay respect to their elders, past and present. We recognize and respect their continuing connections to climate, culture, country, and waters. For more than 130 years, the Dandenong livestock market provided a central focus in town, adding to the economic growth and prosperity in the Dandenong region. Around the time Dandenong became a township in 1852, cattle grazing occupied the fertile lands of Dandenong. In the next decade, an unofficial livestock market began. In 1863, the value of establishing a public market centrally located was agreed upon by residents. And after some debate, a site was chosen at the north entrance to town, on the corner of Lonsdale and McRae Streets. The Dandenong Market opened officially on the 10th of October 1866 with the sale of cattle, pigs and sheep. Farmers sold surplus produce alongside the sale of livestock and pavement stalls soon appeared on the outskirts of the market selling all manner of goods. Travelling merchants also sold their wares from the back of their wagons and carts. By the turn of the century the market was a victim of its own success. For years the site was insufficient and while of great economic benefit to the town and its surrounding businesses, it was difficult and unhygienic to steer livestock through the centre of town. To address the issue, the combined livestock and produce market finally moved to a new location, the corner of Clough and Cleland Streets, where the current Dandenong market resides today. While the market continued to thrive in the following decades, it had once again outgrown its location, in 1958, the livestock market separated, moving to its final, purpose-built location in Cheltenham Road, adjacent to the Dandenong Rail Yards. Now, the stock market could grow and exist in its own right. The market celebrated 125 years of operation in 1991, and although sales occurred four days per week, numbers were declining. And in December 1998, the livestock market closed after operating for 132 years. In the same year, a street parade, dinner and exhibition were held in recognition of the role that the markets had played in the life of the Dandenong region. Following the closure, the auction sale ring, signs and relics were preserved under the roof of the Jack Ray OAM Pavilion at Dandenong Showgrounds, as part of the Dandenong Agricultural and Pastoral Society. For over 130 years, the Dandenong livestock market was one of the state's biggest and busiest and had an enormous impact on the growth, prosperity and character of the Dandenong region. We hope you enjoyed this short snippet of history about Greater Dandenong. This project has been put together with the support of Dandenong and District, and Springvale and District Historical Societies. Without their significant collections and expertise, projects like this would not be possible. City of Greater Dandenong gratefully acknowledges the support of the Victorian Government and Public Record Office Victoria for making this project possible. <laughs>